Dear Mr. Schulz, dear Ambassador and representatives of the Consular Corps, Ms. Klitschko and Ms. Golding, dear jury members of the Anchor Awards, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Hamburg and to the Reeperbahn Festival. For the next days, the festival will turn Hamburg into the European capital of music, with more than 400 shows by established artists and promising newcomers from around the world. At the same time, thousands of industry experts will come together to discuss the music business, to exchange ideas and to build new connections. This year, there is a special focus on the United States, one of Germany's closest international partners, the biggest music market in the world, and home to a highly influential music scene. The Reeperbahn Festival is a unique celebration of live music and club culture, and it addresses important future topics for the music industry, such as diversity and sustainability. In addition, this year's festival and conference give a special platform to voices from Ukraine. The war against our European neighbor causes great suffering and has led to a shift in the international security order. It has resulted in an energy crisis that has consequences for all of us, for our economies, for the music and events industry, for our daily lives. In the face of war, it is vital that democracies around the world stand together for peace and freedom. This is the message from Hamburg tonight. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we live in challenging times. The Reeperbahn Festival is a colorful expression of creativity, artistic freedom, and hope for the future. In this spirit, I, want, I would like to thank Alexander Schulz, Detlef Schwarte, their team, and the many, the many others who have been working hard to organize this event. I wish all guests and musicians great concerts, a successful conference, a good time in Hamburg, and now a great first night at the Reeperbahn Festival 2022. Thank you very much. Applause